Hello viewers. In this video, I'm going to explain how to design a MATLAB code for a numerical scheme that has been proposed in a research paper titled Modeling Attractors of Chaotic Dynamical Systems with Fractal Fractional Operators. The paper was published in 2019 by Professor Abdon Atangana and me. Let me show you the numerical scheme. The numerical scheme is given by equation 3.23. So you can see in this numerical scheme, there are three equations. There are three equations because the dynamical system that I have chosen for the purpose of simulation contains three differential equations. Let me show you the dynamical system. So now as you can see on your screen, the dynamical system is given by equation 3.4. So it is a set of three differential equations. The first differential equation is a nonlinear differential equation because of this term h which has been defined by the term involving trigonometric function sign with an argument of the dependent variable, making the equation, the first equation, as nonlinear. Whereas second and third are linear differential equations, but the system is a nonlinear system of differential equations, which is now being investigated under fractal fractional operators in the atangana baliano sense. So let me show you a MATLAB code for the simulation of this nonlinear system given by equation 3.4. Let's go to MATLAB. Now you can see on line number nine, I have defined some inputs including h to be 0 0.01, which is a step size, the first value of independent variable 0.1, the final point of the integration interval is 100, t shows the integration interval, capital N is the number of iterations. Line number 10 is the values of initial conditions. Line number 11 is arbitrarily chosen value for fractional order alpha. Line number 12, once again, arbitrarily chosen value for tau to be to 0 0.66, and this is called fractal dimension. Line number 13 shows values of the parameters which are required to be substituted in the nonlinear system. Line number four is the value for the constant AB, which is defined as a normalization factor in ABC definition, Atangana Baliano Caputo definition. Now you can see line number 16, 17, and 18 is the nonlinear system that was given in the research paper by equation 3.4. Now you can see on your screen this for loop is very important, and there are three equations in the for loop because we have three differential equation in a dynamical system. So you can see that this is the same scheme that I had shown you in the research paper by equation 3.23. So easy to code that nonlinear, that uh, scheme for the nonlinear differential equations. Now I have plotted, I have given the command of plot to get the phase portrait y versus x. So let's run this code to get the graph of this phase portrait. So I'm going to press the run button and then we will be having the picture of the required plot. It is going to take a couple of seconds because we have comparatively large integration interval. I need to 
wait for a couple of seconds to see the graph of the result. Meanwhile, let me show you line number 21. You can see a command with the name tick, which is given before the for loop. And you can see after the loop ends, I have written the command top. These two commands will help us to compute the time that is being consumed for, uh, by this code or by this loop to give us picture. So you can see now we have obtained the required face portrait and let's go to the command window to see how much time was elapsed. So you can see 48.55 seconds have been elapsed to produce this face portrait by the for loop. So that's it. This was all about the numerical scheme that has been proposed in this research paper for the dynamical system which is being investigated with fractal fractional operators in the Atangana Baliano sense. So now if you are given any nonlinear dynamical system, no matter how many equations it contains, you can easily design the MATLAB code for the purpose of simulations. You just need to change a couple of lines and the required parameter values. You can change the step size. You can even change the value of the fractional order alpha and the fractal dimension tau. And then you will have different kinds of behavior for the dynamical system with fractal fractional operators in the Atangana Baliano sense. Thank you for watching.